Hello, this is Pamela. Welcome to my channel. Grab you a cup of coffee, sit back and relax, and enjoy some yarny goodness. Hello, this is Pamela, and you are on Pamela's Adoring Crochet. Welcome to my channel. Sit back, relax, grab you some coffee, and let's enjoy some good crochet talk. Um, I would like to say thank you for all the comments that you guys have been leaving for me. I really appreciate that. Uh, today's video, um, I do have two finished objects to show you guys, and, well, I have several whips, so I may just kind of show one of the whips, because I have several, so, um, I'm going to show you my yarn haul from, uh, I think it's Line, yeah, from Line Brand, uh, so, yeah, let's go ahead and get with that first, and get the good yarn out of the way, okay, on Line Brand, I had recently discovered some uh, jean yarn. Now, it may not be new to a lot of you guys, but it is new to me. Here it is. It's jean yarn, and it is. this is called Top Stitch, and I showed this in my other videos. Um, it's 246 yards, a medium four weight. Um, let's see. 100% acrylic. Look at there just gorgeous. I believe I bought like four of these and I'm telling you guys, this is super soft. This is so nice. I can't wait to get started on something for fall for this. Oh my gosh, I'm loving it. Well, I had bought, Hershner's had where you bought, buy three of them and they were like $8.97 and so I ordered two packs, two different colors. Well, they got canceled. I guess Hershner's ran out so I didn't get it. But, I had also placed an order with a uh, line brand. So I'm excited to show you guys um, what I ordered. Let's see. I don't know why I got so much of this same color. Let's see. This is classic. Um, okay, no, they're, they're different. I was gonna say they've got to be different, but they sure look the same. Okay, this says, classic so they they are different um so i ordered four so there's a three pack and then this one isn't it just beautiful oh my gosh um and this one is called classic and it's the same specs on it i believe yeah it's the same specs but look at the color combinations of that scarf how good these colors go together <laughs> Um, so I ordered that one and then I ordered another set, which my gosh, it looks so much like it and it's called uh, brand new and I'll show you um, what I'm talking about. Now I can see in the video now they, there is a difference, but in person it's so subtle. I mean like real subtle, <laughs> but on here, yeah, let's see. There you go. It kind of, in the camera, it, this bottom one looks like it might have some purple in it, but it doesn't. Or at least in person with my eye, it doesn't. Anyway, so I bought four of those, four of these, and you guys know that when I buy something like this that I really like, I try to buy at least a thousand yards because in case I'm gonna make me a cardigan or a top or something out of it, I wanna make sure I got plenty of yarn to do that with. So I always try to buy at least a thousand yards of something if I know that I like it. Um, also, this four weight seems more like a three to me. And oh, it's so soft. Okay, the other one that I got, I got another blue. I, I want more colors than this, guys. I'm gonna have to go back online and see what else they have or whenever they've had their next sale. But here it is, I bought four of this. And this color is called Stonewash. So this one will probably be the first one that I actually use. But here's all three of the blues. <laughs> they are so pretty. Um, then the last color that I got is this gray. And you know, we all need a gray cardigan, right? It goes with everything. This is called Vintage. There you go. So that's my uh, yarn haul 
from Line Brand is I got me some more of the jeans. I, I'm thinking though, I'm gonna have to double check, but I think on this one, I only bought one, two, three, four. Okay, so I bought enough, yeah. So I have four of these. So those are all the colors that I bought in that. So that's my line brand. I hope you guys like that. Okay, so the other thing that I was gonna tell you guys about is um, I am working on a shawl and I'm call gonna call it the mermaid shawl. And I'm using this Mandela yarn for it. And it will probably take um, just a little bit into a second cake, but that's going to be the colors coming up on the shawl pattern that I'm fixing to be doing a tutorial on, but it's called Mermaid. It's a three weight. Um, I just love this. It's just beautiful. Uh, and it's actually called Mermaid and that's why I'm calling the shawl Mermaid. It's going to be called the Mermaid Shawl. Uh, it's a three light, 590 yards in here. So be looking for that tutorial because <laughs> uh, I'm really excited about working on that. Um, I've just got to make it. <laughs> so, okay. So the other thing is I did make two shawls this week and one of them is my own shawlette pattern. And here it is. And it's that glitzy yarn that you guys all convinced me to go ahead and try. And I do love it. I love the colors. Look at that. It did turn out really pretty. <laughs> Where I messed up, as you can tell, the top right there. See? <laughs> um, it's like wonky. And when I go to put it on, that turns in like that on my back. So... Um, I'm just going to leave it because how I'm actually going to wear it is, and it won't matter, but I can't really wear it as a shawl, shawl the other way, but I can wear it this way. <laughs> so, isn't that pretty? So I'm looking forward to wearing this and I, I've never, I can wear this out like, like that, or I can actually tuck it in. Cause I had it, when I did it in front of the bathroom mirror, I was able to like tuck this all the way around like that. And um, it was so pretty. And I think it was something like that, but you guys know what I'm talking about. Anyway, and so I'm keeping it. I'm not gonna change my goof up on it. Um, what I did is I forgot to do the two double crochet uh, chain one, two double crochet on my point. I did one double crochet, one chain, one double crochet. And I did not realize, cause see, I didn't even, wasn't even reading my pattern. I was just kind of going off memory and I don't know what I was thinking, but I quickly figured it out. It make the change obviously, because see, it did come out right there at the bottom. But yeah, it started off and I was like, why is it doing that? Anyway, so there we go. It is pretty. <laughs> There we are. And um, I can wear it the way that I showed you. I will just be wearing it more this fall. And um, I'm pretty excited about it. So I thank you guys for encouraging me to go ahead and make the shiny uh, because I wasn't going to. <laughs> now, the other one that I have is, it's the same my pattern as the shawlette. I, it's just, I did it in a shawl. So I made it like right here. And I am loving this one. I love the greens. It will be my, it's green and um, mint green. It may look turquoise on the camera, but it, that's actually a mint green. So it's like a lime green, a faded green, and a mint green, white, and a beige. And I, uh, I do love this one a lot. And like I said, I was needing something green. Some kind of shawl. Let's see if we can see the back of it. Pretty good. Do it like that. So, anyway, I am very excited about this one. There we go. It, um, that is my finished object. Oh, I guess I could show you up close. <laughs> 
There we go. Okay, now the other thing is my finished object. And I am, not finished object, I'm sorry, my work in progress. I am using this Premier Home cotton. And it's a four weight and the color is uh, Princess. And I, with this right here, that pretty? With that yarn, I am making uh, another one of these. I've made two of them, I think, already. I'm making this right here. It's a free pattern. And I believe I got this off of, it says mush, mushrump.com. M-U-S-H-R-U-M-P.com. Um, it was free at the time. So, um, I'll, I'll look it up, leave the link below, and if it's still free, I don't know. It was free at the time that I printed it, but there it is. And I really like this pattern. I've already made a couple of them. And this one is going to um, my niece. And so I'm working on that one. Um, okay, this is a short video. <laughs> so that's all, oh yeah, let's see. That's all that I have on my crochet stuff. Okay, everyone, I'm sorry. Um, I had already put everything up, my shawls and all the stuff and changed clothes and did all that. And then I realized, oh, wait a minute. I didn't even show the viewers what yarn I used for my shawls. So I apologize for that. So I've come back. I've already got my, I'm back, got, uh, got back from church. I already got my comfy clothes on. And um, so I remembered that part. <laughs> so please forgive me. Um, so I want to show you what yarn I used. For the uh, shawlette that I gooped up on, I did use this shawl in a ball. And the color was called Graceful Green is the color of the, that shawlette that I showed you guys. And it's a medium four weight and 481 yards was in that. And like I said, I apologize for that, but here we go. At least it's in the video, right? Okay. The um, the green shawl, I now have a green shawl in my collection. I used this cupcake and I used one ball or one cake and then this much is what I have left of the second one. Now I could have gone a little bit more because I do like my shawls nice and big. I like to wrap up in them, um, but I just, I don't know. I finally just stopped right there, but that's how much I have left in the second cake. And just to tell you, this is called Sandcastle, was the name of it. There's 590 yards in this, and it's a three light, 100% acrylic. <laughs> so, and it's line brand. So, uh, yeah, so that was my green one. So, sorry about that, guys. So, let's go ahead and uh, let's do our words of life here. <laughs> um. He shall give his angels charge concerning thee, and in their hands they shall bear thee up. Matthew 4, 6. <laughs> okay, so I hope you guys have enjoyed that. Um, in my next video, I will be doing a... Um, I do have some couple more items that are almost finished. And I will show those. I don't want to show them right now because I'm on the verge of being finished. And I don't want to show you until it's actually finished. So I will get that together. And then I have some Happy Mail that I've gotten. And I have a, um, like a, um, a hook review that uh, my daughter had actually bought me some hooks. And so I'm going to do a separate video for that. So be looking for that. Um, that's all that I have. If you would like to like and share my video, uh, subscribe to my, my channel, that'd be great. And of course, I love comments. Oh my gosh, please leave the comments. Um, that's all that I have for today's video. So um, I will see you in my next video. Thank you very much.